so in today's lecture of pda i am going to do one theorem that is a necessary and sufficient condition that the perfine differential equation x dr is equal to 0 should be integrable is that x curl of x is equal to 0 okay so prove that the necessary and sufficient condition that the perfine differential equation x into dr is equal to 0 should be integrable is that x into curl of x is equal to 0 this is the theorem suppose that p of x comma y comma z dx plus q of x comma y comma z dy plus r of x comma y comma z dz is equal to 0 that is x into dr is equal to 0 suppose if this is integrable then we have a relation of the form f of x comma y comma z is equal to c1 okay where this c1 is constant okay taking total derivative of f if i take a total derivative of f we get dy f by dou x dx plus dy f by dou y dy plus dy f by dou z dz is equal to 0 and comparing with p dx plus q dy plus r dz is equal to 0 so what i am doing is i am comparing this with this now this implies dy f by dou x is equal to mu p uh, comma dy f by dou y is equal to mu q, mu q comma dy f by dou z is equal to mu r that is such that mu x is equal to grad f okay grad f is equal to what operator f is equal to dy f upon dou x comma dy f by dou y comma dy f by dou z okay so what is your dy f by dou x is nothing but mu p in the bracket mu p comma what is dy f by dou y mu q what is dy f by dou z it is nothing but r right mu r so take this mu to be common outside then what is left p q and r over here p q and r which is equal to mu of x what is this p q r it is nothing but x so now uh, curl of grad of f is equal to zero curl that is curl of what is grad of f nothing but mu x so in place of grad f right mu of x is equal to 0 then mu of x into curl of mu of x is equal to 0 then again x into curl of x is equal to 0 so finally we got this answer hence the theorem or hence we proved you can say so with this we are done with the today's theorem in the next lecture i will be doing one more theorem before that see let us so, so we got x curl of x is equal to 0 over here. I hope you all have understood today's lecture and thanks for watching.